Bell Harbor here, and I'm with... Say friends! Hey, friends! Welcome back! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're going to get down to business. Mm. Um, Exciting things happening this time. Yeah, actually, I think so. I'm really excited to see. First, we'll go into the happy news to set this off right. Yeah. I didn't realize he was... Well, maybe I did. That's piano. Right? Okay. I hate when their eyes are half-lidded like, like her ear. Yeah. She looks like, like ever, looks like, yes, like you ever like see like your dog or your cat or whatever, and they're sleeping, and their eyes are like it's like ugh, like are they okay? <laughs> like close them all the way, please. They look a little extra wonky. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but speaking of wonky, yeah, she is expecting her first child, mm-hmm. and behind her, I'm not gonna make us all dizzy, but behind her a little bit, we see here her twin quote quote <laughs> sister Tonky mm-hmm. also about to have her first baby here's proud daddy piano I really hope they look like him because I like he's the a grand piano <laughs> <God. laughs> uh, and we've got the midwife mm-hmm. slash well she won't I did like the idea of um Haley had of the god acting as a godmother type mm-hmm. thing yeah definitely um so she can definitely be the She'll be the midwife because she's right there ready to help out. Mm-hmm. Um, and just in case these ladies need to run to do something else, she'll watch the babies. We have White Dot who's just kind of like keeping up. And when we remember, mm-hmm. we had Beluga mm-hmm. who was just eating some food constantly because he didn't know what else to do with himself. But then his eyes <gasps> fell upon Azula. The fire princess mm. of his dreams, <laughs> <laughs> running and darting through the grass, and he's like, "What was that?" So he, you can hear him just whoosh, 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 in the bushes. <laughs> he comes out and he sees her. <gasps> what a vision! And we're lucky because they do not have overlapping genes, Mm-mm. so they would have a healthy baby. Yeah, might be a dark face, but it would be healthy. <laughs> So that might be another budding and blossoming and yeah. good thing. They're, the good color scheme, too, if you're thinking yeah. like that. Yeah. Well, yeah, and if we can get the male with the red fur and the black mm-hmm. horns, and maybe that's what we should put in there for him is black horns. Oh, he doesn't even have horns. Anyway. <laughs> um, then I think Rose and Sunflower are just kind of hanging around, doing their thing, trying to bring the tribe. Mm-hmm. Well, Rose is there for a reason. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's the sad part. You can't, can't dance around that anymore. No. After leading the tribe through some very difficult times and bringing them finally to this beautiful island. Mm-hmm. Actually, it is one of the prettiest I've seen with yeah. the amount of water to flowers and stuff. It is time for our dear and beloved Tara to pass to Nishling Heaven. Mm. She comes from a, a developing line of Sassanola. Yeah. Um, she did a great job, had adopted her, adopted son Beluga down here, because he just washed up on shore <laughs> after his own, his birth mother was hoping that he would find something, and he did. Mm-hmm. And so with her last breath, she passed it to him, and with her last breath, um, I think Tara would approve of the mating, or the companionship of Azula and mm-hmm. Beluga, because she loves them both. Yeah. Um, and you can see we were lucky enough to have Tara be in the middle of all of her um, most immediate, I mean, she loves everybody, but right, <laughs> her most yeah. immediate like, family. Yeah. She did finally get to have a child of her own with Venuta here, mm-hmm. our wanderer, very steadfast, good guy. He's just yeah. been, you know, we, all around good guy. <laughs> yeah. Possibly from the same drifting yeah. place from Beluga. Um, and so Tara and he had this little spitfire of a girl mm-hmm. spirit <laughs> six attack she's just yeah, she's ready to get it yes she is intense <laughs> yeah. so it would be great if um azula and beluga if they have a baby maybe they could have a son mm-hmm. and that would bring the two lines together because yeah. then they could be together so it is with a heavy heart that we must say goodbye to yet another niche thing Poor Tara. Mm. But we've got some things to look forward to. Mm-hmm. So without further ado, doodly doo. Goodbye, Tara. Mm. But Ooh. Rose is there as godmother to Spirit. So yeah. and she Spirit has her daddy right there too, so Yeah. So she's like, I, I barely knew you, but I'll be here. And he's like, Oh. Okay. Let's give her her pink because now she's old enough to leave the nest. Mm-hmm. 
And you know she wants to. Yes. <laughs> Good luck to Rose reeling her in. I know, right? <laughs> she just was going to like jump right in. Like, mm-hmm. You could just see her like trying to hold her back and she's trying to like jump in the water and catch the fish. Yes. <laughs> Reminds me of my Cecily. Oh. <laughs> so let's um, see. Mm-hmm. Let's give him, he does have squinty eyes. She's got good eyes. So I think we should give him one good eye just to make sure that... Yeah, that's important. um, Then, what does she have? She has had no children. She definitely has some sort of horns. So we could put more black horn. I don't know if that would help. Because it is recessive. Yeah. So we could put black horn to help her try to get black horn. Yeah, let's try it. Yeah. Um, She's got some good recessive things like spiky body. That'd be great. Mm -hmm. Okay, right. So let's try that out. And since he has no possibility of horns, we could put horns in his to help fight that. Yeah, I think we should. I think we're so close to getting that. Um, yeah. Spirit might, might could have. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's give him horns because I think, you know, she, she Azula has always been our strong leader too. She's a little mm. bit more cautious than Tara was perhaps, but I think she, she'd see Beluga and be like, all right, what do you have to offer? He's like, well. I am really interested in horns. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so I, I think she's so oh, okay. You know, she's been looking for a mate too. She mm-hmm. didn't have anybody either. Yeah. She, um, and he does come with some differing genes. Mm-hmm. Let's see. He's got BH. What did you have? BH. That's why I thought that might be related. So, ooh, they could have a. Wow, she came out BH. It's amazing <laughs> for HB, but. Um, so. It, yeah, their child will definitely well, still that's be. okay. We can keep the two super lines. Yes. But we need to have... Um, yeah, the pia- to piano... Have piano... I was, I was saying it weird. Sorry. <laughs> He's got two on the way. So they might yeah. uh, have someone. Yeah, let's not look at them yet. Mm. <laughs> Although I did glance. Somebody looks a lot like a strawberry over there. But <laughs> <laughs> So who do you, you think he would probably ask her? Since she, she just Yeah, I think she'd appreciate side. that initiative. So she's eating some berries or about to. He says... <clears throat> he looks like he'd probably be a little clumsy, but yeah. maybe he has what she'd like. No. She she didn't appreciate that very much, so let's have her just eat a berry. Maybe she was hungry, mm-hmm. so he took her to dinner. Yes. <laughs> let's have him ask again, because he does have pretty low fertility. What is hers? Oh, no, she's got great fertility. It's him. <laughs> Try again. There we go. Aww. She's like, okay. <laughs> so, um, I don't. There's really no reason for her not to have her baby. Yeah. So let's have little spirit step over here. We'll have Azula step over here, and she can pick some more fi- food. Fish. <laughs> pick some fish. He's up like, yeah, I want to be a daddy. <gasps> He's probably so excited. So he's yeah. a trip over here so he can be there when the birthing happens. Mm-hmm. Um, Venuta probably would go this way. What do you think he'd do? I think so. I mean, he might want to be, you know, keep a, a, a small eye on Spirit, but Rose is there to help. Um, yeah. But yeah, I think he would want to honor Tara by just taking a moment to be like, yeah, let me go explore. I don't know that he'd be like the, he, obviously he's not the leader. Um, right. But I think, you know, yeah, just this round, he might want to trudge ahead. Okay. But he'll help clear some grass so we mm-hmm. can get there. Then Rose, she sees another baby on the way. Don't really need her to do much, so she could just pick some grass. And yeah, just stay clear it out so the others can come. Yeah. yeah. Um, I know the grass helps them hide, but we're in a peaceful place, so. And I don't like <laughs> when the grass is on there because you can't see yeah. it. Yeah. All right, and then we have a little this is sunflower. Yeah. So sunflower... You could pick some berries for us for our growing tribe. Um, I guess let's move forward. Start going this way a little bit. Mm-hmm. We're really just meandering. Yeah. But now we're a little bit split up. So we <laughs> so here's White Dot. White Dot could swim for us potentially. Hmm. Just go over to that really mini island uh, yeah, peninsula thing. Yeah. Let's see if she can. Run. Um, I don't want to leave her in the water. She could jump in, and if she can't get out, yeah, then come back there. over. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So hard to see for some reason. She can make it. Okay, 
She was like, heck yeah, man. <laughs> Basically stepped in a puddle, but yeah. you know, that's a lot for them. They don't have yeah. swimming ability. All right. What do we have over here? Mm, that is pink. That is a pink child. That is super cute, though. Uh, dirt face. Yeah, derpy. <laughs> uh, oh, she, you know, she, she does look like a strawberry. Like, a girl yeah. Diablo or something done. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, she's good. She's got the F-A, so if we're mixing up the jeans. We've got a BH is out of the other end, yeah. so that's good. You know, except for the unfortunate dirt face, which isn't that bad, except for that, like, it's the underbite to me that gets me. But, like, yeah. she's actually super cute. She's pink yeah. with black horns. Like, that's awesome. Yeah, and the green eyes. Yeah. She's, she's a little bit uh, Christmassy. Mm, that's true. She just needed antlers. Aww. <laughs> All right, so she's a little bit of familiar in the back. And there's a red and white. Double velvet paw, so she's a sneaky little girl. That would have been great for a, a unicorn. Yeah, a unicorn. <laughs> You know, she's probably going to be super friends with Spirit, and they're going to, like, play together in the wishes or whatever, so she's going to sneak, yeah. and then, like, Spirit's just going to jump out. <laughs> That's true, because Spirit's got both of those mm-hmm. claw hands, so yeah. we'll have to have her catch up. Uh, we need a name for her, but let's go see our other child back here. I see some Oh, it looks, daddy yeah, patterns. maybe dead. Daddy pattern. Whoa. Whoa, look at his eyes. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's another girl. It's like a panda. Oh, she looks like a panda. Yeah. But not as much as Winter Bear to me. Well, she's not as dark. Oh, look at her little tiny back paws have a little black. Aww. <laughs> she is very interesting. She yeah. looks like she's a white nicheling with black spots. She's actually a black nicheling with white spots. Mm-hmm. That's weird. So, where is her pattern? It is white. Okay. Because the black looks a little bit gray. T- oh, yeah. I like the ears. <laughs> Beaver tail. Where'd that come from? Mm. Relas. What was the other one's name? Ramada or something? Ramella. Ramella and Relasi. They're ooh, very similar. Yeah. Twin girls again. One a derp, one not. Yeah. <laughs> but we did get the horns on uh, mm-hmm. a little strawberry over here. Okay, well, um, I think like we had discussed... Um, that's right, because they had... Um, but I think we did decide that they could keep having babies mm-hmm. because they're not related. Correct. Like, they had the great same grandfather or something like that, or father. Yeah, we won't That's right, that. we're not going to get into that. <laughs> <laughs> but I think we did say that piano Technically, and... Tonky and Piano are some sort of yeah. sibling, I think, actually. I don't even think they're cousins. I think they're actually half-siblings. Okay. That's fine. We will not dwell. The thing was done, and we have a beautiful little girl. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Wonky and Piano are not actually related at all, to my knowledge. Right, okay. All right, well, we won't have Wonky go too far, but I think she'll come over here, and she can pick some things. Oh, she was just right enough. We don't need those masks right now. Then, Tonky, I know, wants to be a good mother, but she knows and trusts that Night Cloud can watch her baby. Mm-hmm. I'd like her to actually follow uh, White. Yeah. Man. So she's had her baby, and she's not, I don't want her to look like she's abandoning it, but um, she does want to get back to exploring a little mm-hmm. bit, so um, we'll have her sister catch up. But I wanted to see if she could come over and give support to White Dog. Looks like she can. Oh, she's back to the bush. There we go. Good. I am wondering, how much are we towards swimming, paw? Mm. Ooh, we only need five more. We can get oh. wet paw. Uh, we need to do a lot more digging. And no birds. No cold. Yeah, some of these just didn't present themselves to us. It's kind of hard. Yeah. So maybe piano and night clouds should just dip their feet and come back in. <laughs> right, yeah, just keep, <laughs> keep practicing. All right, piano. So why don't you please destroy this for me? Um, he might want to keep going that way. Actually, the whole little tribe could keep going that way. I don't want him to drown, though, so mm-hmm. <laughs> you wait. All right. And then she can just clear some grass and watch the baby. All right. Yeah. Pretty Successful event. day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. We need names for our tiny babies. Mm-hmm. Um, and we will be right back. Okay. And we're back. Woo. 
you have names. Yeah. <laughs> I think they're really good names, too. Yeah, I like them. I think they fit pretty well. Mm-hmm. So, oh, I just realized her nose is white. That's cool. No. So, for our little daughter of piano, mm-hmm. we have... Belle. Belle. Thank you very much, Haley Bear, for that one. Man, her eyes are a little bit un- unnerving, but... <laughs> <laughs> I, do little, like yeah. I do yes. like yellow eyes. I do like yellow eyes. I think it's just I expect the black to be bigger. I guess. Yeah. So. Yeah. I think. Yeah. That, that's what's it's throwing off. It's a little um, illusionally illusion. What's it? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so we have little Bell, mm-hmm. and then for this lovely little child, <laughs> we have Rosy Coral. Rosy Coral. Because she's rosy and mm-hmm. coral is a pink kind of color. So thank you very much, Moth Lily, for that one. So Rosy Coral and Belle. Yay. Pretty names. Very yes. dainty, I think. Mm-hmm. Okay. So now let's get to the next day. Woo. I'm excited to see what we can find. Hopefully yes. we find some more nichelings because <laughs> yeah. we still need boys. Come mm. on, guys. All right. Woo. Come on, Azula. We know you want to have a boy. A red boy with black horns. Mm-hmm. No pattern. And go. Whoa. Oh. It is a boy. He is red. Oh, he doesn't have the black horns. I mean, he is so close, though. He is cool. Whoa, those eyes. Ooh, Whoa. A-B. Shocking blonde hair. Wow. He's cool looking. Mm-hmm. Doesn't have a very much attack. But he's no, I was surprised well by that. Yeah. Yeah. He's still got bird beak, but we didn't get some. Um... Oh, the spiky bunny? Yeah, thank you. And somebody, I don't know, I hope it's still there. Somebody had heat body going, but. Oh. But it didn't come through. And that one I've only seen like twice. It looks really cool. So. Mm. All right, so well, now we need a name for him. So be right back again. Okay, we're mm-hmm. back again. And. We had picked a name that was a little too nerdy, mm-hmm. and I think he got offended. Yes. <laughs> so he said, wait, wait, wait. So we went back to the list and tried again, and we got... Zenith. Zenith. Thank you, Game Detective. That fits him, I think. Yeah. At yeah, least it's a cool good. name, and he lo- he's a cool-looking guy. Yeah, he is pretty cool. So he's AB, and oh. she is HB. That's right. We knew that was going to happen. But... Mm-hmm. All right, let's go for this. But so he okay, I'm sorry. So he was A B F A C A. Mm. Man. <sighs> we need some more people to join our tribe. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> I know there's C's. an age difference, but how about um like um uh, white dot? Oh she's an A. Mm-hmm. And um is it sun Ooh, is flower? Okay, I couldn't remember. Ooh, so she's, she's got C A. So they, oh, he's got, oh, no, that was the other one. A, B. Oh, yeah, because yeah. the H's were getting us before. So if she can hold out three days, how old is yeah. she? Yeah. Six. Okay. Okay. It's a little weird because, but she wasn't there when he was birthed. That's what always gets me is that, like, she, they didn't grow up, you know, like. Yeah. <laughs> so she's exploring, and when he grows up, things might happen. <laughs> yeah, wow. We really need them to have babies, and she needs to have yeah. a son. Yeah. <laughs> and she needs to not take any of these bees with her. If she could keep the baby with, like, A, C, yeah. that'd be the best. Because we, do, yeah, we don't the need H's, H and the Bs. No. Or maybe these ladies who are crossing the river will find a gentleman who yeah. would like to share his F or D. Or... <laughs> All right, so now let's get down to business again. I always get down to business. I'm a business lady. Mm, so. To defeat the Huns. I know, that's what I keep thinking of. All right, we need food, guys. We're not, like, starving Marvin, but... Okay. Um, I don't think anybody's in the... Oh, Venuta's getting a little older. Mm. Um, but I, he's he's had children, right? He just, yeah, well, he just had spirit. And he's also Wonky's dad. Huh. That's huh. interesting to know. Wonky with who? Was Monkey it? with honeysuckle. Oh. Oh, she was pretty. I remember her. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, but probably he doesn't need to have any more children because mm-hmm. I think Azula and Beluga should have another baby. Yeah. Um, maybe just we'll give it a day, but. So let's go ahead and pick this. 
And we're gonna have to cross the water eventually, guys. <laughs> a rock. Heal back. I don't think we're gonna be able to keep her back. Oh, she could destroy the bush. Oh. Um, let's not have her do that yet, but that is a good... Oh, a mole. I bet she sees the mole. Smell it. Mm-hmm. So, let's see. Is she old enough to do that? It... Yeah, because she's so strong. Um, we just need somebody to help get her over there. Well, we need... Actually, no, what we need is for people to move to make the mole spin. Um, okay, so we got Rose. Rose, go ahead and... Pick that, and I guess, oh, she could try digging. Hmm. Oh. All right. Spirit's going in for her first kill, and she's Ooh. only like three days old. She's a teenager? Oh, she's a teenager. Uh. Great. She's a, <laughs> no offense to any teenagers, but she knows what's up. But she's like, you know what? I am raring to go. So mm -hmm. she's just going to jump over here and murder that poor defenseless animal. <laughs> like what <laughs> <laughs> okay so let's have beluga come down to help get that food for her there's another mole over there that she'd probably like to eat oh he could pick some flowers wait flowers mm -hmm. i'm just saying the first thing that comes to my mind yeah it's cool so he'll pick that up he's like oh, i remember this bush yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah so spirit I, even if we see some cute, adorable bunnies, I don't think we can stop her ferocity. No. Mm -mm. But he's and we kind of need it, too. So We do, actually, yeah. But um, mm -hmm. So, yeah, so Beluga will... He knows the dangers of water, so yeah. he'll keep her from going back too far. Um, but next time she can kill this other mole. Mm -hmm. That's good. And um, we'll go, go up this way. So she'll play over here. She's being well attended. Uh, Azula. She could come down and get preggies. And then come back up. We don't have to have her have her baby. She gets okay. big preggers. So she'll ask him this time. Let's see if he's in the mood. Oh, okay. I think they like each other. Yeah. Because he doesn't really have very much fertility. So that's mm. it's always nice. So she'll come up and stay with her beautiful son. So let's see. We were thinking sunflower with mm -hmm. him. So she won't go too far because it's going to be a quick dodge <laughs> and sunflower mm, that one's rose but... oh i'm sorry rose i just think of him that. okay we're pretty settled we need them to keep up so we can either have them cross the water and go with them this way up this little thing or they can go through here and go this way my only concern is how um how are the babies gonna swim well, the babies could go with night mm. cloud this yeah. way. Okay. Yeah, that's and what I was thinking. And then these guys can go this way. Yeah. And we will probably have uh, Piano and Wonky have another baby. But they've got some time. Mm -hmm. They're pretty young still. So let's have let's have them move first because they're in the way. <laughs> so uh, White Dot, go ahead and clear some grass. Don't accidentally jump in the water. <laughs> Oh, there are no bushes, berries anyway. Okay, so clear, jump, and clear. Okay, so now we should be able to come across the water. So piano, if you don't mind. I thought I heard somebody purr. I was like, wait a second, what? Mm. <laughs> and do that. Ooh, fishies. And then wonky. Okay. Sorry, the sound effects are just yeah, so weird. that was weird. Like it's like it splashed before she got in the water. So mm -hmm. I was like, was that a leech? No, we just have the baby. Okay. So now these little children. Is it? So does someone have a leech? No. What's that water sound? Maybe there's. Maybe it's the fish. Oh. Maybe the fish make a sound. We just never noticed it before. That's weird. I guess so. And I. <laughs> Behind the scenes, I turned the sound effects down a little bit because the water was really loud. So I'm glad I did. <laughs> um, so I don't know what that sound is. <laughs> if you know in the comments what that squishy sound is, I'm, I'm gonna let's just say it's the fish, and I'll just stop yeah. being distracted. So um, her first duty, Night Cloud's duty as a um, 
midwife and pretty much godmother because now she's <laughs> parents just abandoned their children. I think she's going to be the one to give them their designations for male and female. Hmm. Um, so far they all <laughs> they all identify as the gender they were born. So she will also pick up this thing. And I don't want her to leave their side, but maybe she'd like a little bit of a different. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm really distracted. Is there... Like a person yeah. fishing. Like, that sounded like a clam mm. coming. I mean, but maybe it was well, this clam? Maybe. I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm no, distracted. that's very... No, it's I'm very really odd. It's <laughs> disconcerted. Yeah. Okay. I just don't want anything to attack our guys, but uh, it's peaceful, yeah, so it's, right. it wouldn't. Yeah, but you never know. Yeah. Um, okay, well, she has one more move, but I don't want her to move. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, she yeah, just jumped back and she's... forth, so she'll just stay. Mm -hmm. It's weird. When she blinks, her eyelids are, like, red or something. Blink. Yeah, I noticed that when we <laughs> when they were sleeping. I noticed that. Oh. There you go, yeah. I'm staring at you, Night Cloud. Whoa. Uh, got real close. Oh, look at her little whiskers. Oh. Wow, you can see yeah. in her eyes. She's got like... They really it's did pretty. detail. Mm -hmm. Are you looking at me? Mm. <laughs> yeah. um, Alright. Well, I think that'll do it for this time. Mm -hmm. We didn't really go anywhere, but I feel like a lot has happened. Yeah, um, We're starting definitely. to develop new bonds. Mm -hmm. We're starting to see their personalities come out, like that little exploring group up to the north, um, the twin sisters. Hold on. Well, you know what I mean. Keeping together, and then pianos going along with them. Uh, White Dot finally gets to do something. It was mm -hmm. her idea to go that way, so yeah. she thought it was pretty cool. Um, then we got the... Night Cloud finally is stepping up to be a midwife. She didn't really get a chance before. Now she's got two. Yeah. But at least she's got the peaceful ones because I think those two yes. are equal to one of the spirit over here. Mm -hmm. um, taking a whole village to raise her. Oh, yeah, right? And then Zenith, he, he's a pretty calm dude. Yeah. He looks, could be Californian with his slick He does hair. look Californian. <laughs> Blue eyes. Yes. But his hair was just like blonde, blonde. It's kind of white blonde, but mm -hmm. yeah. Um, we've got a few more days. I don't think we're losing anybody immediately. Venuta's getting a little older. Um, and I know we do have Rose and Sunflower. Um, everybody's aging a little bit. I'm not yeah. super worried because we are at least having some babies. While they might not be able to breed necessarily, are young so that they can keep going. We start to run into problems if we have them where they can't breed. We either breed and potentially have some sick nichelings. Um, I don't want them to die out. I can honestly say in all of my time playing niche, I've never seen it where you don't have some wanderers show up mm. and the rogues or something. Yeah. So um, we also didn't run into as much like fighting and food that as I would have expected. Mm -hmm. um, so I don't know if it's because we're playing at a slightly slower pace than I usually do because I'm usually just tearing through. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know. Anyway, but we'll... We'll just keep hoping. Maybe we'll find a stump and somebody can sing. Yeah. And get, please be a boy. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's the Noodle Doops for today. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank you very much for all of your suggestions in lore. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, just storylines. Mm -hmm. um, if you'd like to see anybody... If, if maybe you saw somebody who could pair up that we missed. Mm -hmm. um, or if you think it's worth it to... Gamble. Do more risking for biscuits. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but we've, we've been lucky so far, so let's yes. not push our luck. Right. But, um, all right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Stay crazy.